one of the things that people, one of the most common questions that people ask about a blade itself is, um, how do you know when to change it and things like that. So basically the blades that we're actually using today, as I say, are the straightforward standard um, feather blades that we're going to be using within the Flexion Razor. The, the kind of the other blades that you would use would be within the artist range. Again, now these blades are they're designed for a different thing. These are shaving razor blades, which are used for a one use only per client. So once you would put a brand new blade in for every client, and then you would remove and put the blade in a disposable sharp box after use. Whereas when we're using the um, the styling razors. The whole concept is that with these, we're using them more and more on the head. So this blade itself is really quite sharp. It's a brand new blade that's in. So what this is gonna do is, it's gonna be really a little bit harder to use initially, which is another reason why we were talking about the fact that it should be 90 degrees from the actual hair shaft itself. Whereas when we're working with a shaving razor, you want it to be flat. Okay, so with these ones, we will use it and we'll kind of break the blade in, maybe take the edge off it a little bit. So gradually as we're using it more and more, what we're gonna be uh, finding is that the blade naturally will become a little bit more blunt and more blunt and more blunt the more we use it. So if you work, and again, I'm giving you an example here. Let's say you get 10 haircuts. 10, 10 haircuts out of a blade. So the first two or three haircuts will be very difficult. They will be quite, it's really quite sharp. So again, you have to be really quite soft and quite gentle. All the more uh, importance of using it towards 90 degrees. The more the blade is used to three, four, five, six sort of haircuts, we are starting to open the blade up a little bit more because the blade itself is getting that little bit more blunt. So therefore we have to open it slightly and we have to push more to give us a little bit more tension. Once the blade starts to get seven, eight, nine, sort of 10 haircuts around about there, and obviously the higher you get, the more blunt it gets. The blade itself will start to become blunt in certain areas. Maybe if you tend to use the point of the blade more, or if you use the middle or the back, you know, if you use one area more than the other, it will become blunt more quick, quickly. So gradually as you get towards the end of the blade, you're having to open the razor a lot more. You're having to lean that little bit heavier and you're removing less hair. This is telling you the blade's coming to the end of its life. So just be aware that, that for the styling range, you want the blades to be used to break them in a little bit and you get you know, maybe 10 haircuts roughly out of a blade. If you're doing a full razor cut like this, you'll probably only get five haircuts out of the razor, because out of the blade. Purely and simply, you're using it an awful lot more. Um, once we use the artist range for the shaving, or the, um, the nape razor, again, these blades, they're touching the skin, they're a single-use blade.